Hello and welcome to tonight's Torah portion. Before we get started, I'm going to say a customary blessing. Blessed art thou, Lord our God, King and Universe, who sanctified us with his commandments and commanded us to engross ourselves with the words of Torah. Please, Lord our God, sweeten the words of your Torah in our mouths and in the mouths of all your people, Israel. May we and our offspring, the offspring of your people, the house of Israel, may we all together know your name and study your, your Torah for for the sake of fulfilling your desire. Blessed are you, Lord, who teaches Torah to his people Israel. Blessed are you, Lord, our God, King of the Universe, who chose us from all the nations and gave us the Torah. Blessed are you, Lord, giver of the Torah. May the Lord bless you and keep watch over you. May the Lord bestow his presence. May, <laughs> may the Lord make his presence enlighten you. May be kind to you. May the Lord Bestow favor on you and grant you peace. And for those of you who don't know, Lord Yeshua. Yeah, so. And then Lord our God is Adonai. Hmm? Now concerning the coming of our Lord Yeshua HaMashiach and our being gathered together to him, we ask you, brothers, not to be quickly shaken in mind or alarmed, either by a spirit or a spoken word, or a letter seeming to be form, seeming to be frost, to the effect that the day of the Lord has come. Let no one deceive you in any way, that that day will not come, unless the rebellion comes first, and the man of lawlessness is revealed, the son of destruction who opposes and exalts himself in every so-called God. Excuse me. Who opposes and exalts himself against every so called God or object of worship, so that he takes his seat on, in the temple of Elohim, proclaiming himself to be Elohim. Do you not remember that when I was still with you, I told you these things? And you know that, and you know what is restraining him now, so that he may be revealed in his time. For the mystery of lawlessness is already at work. Only he who now restrains it will do so until he is out of the way. And in the lawless one will be revealed, whom the Lord Yeshua will kill with the breath of his mouth and bring to nothing by appearing, by the appearance of his coming. The coming of, lawless one, of the lawless one is by the activity of Satan with all power and false signs and wonders. And with all wicked deception for those who are perishing, because they refuse to love the truth and so be saved. Therefore Elohim sends them a strong delusion, so that they may believe what is false, in order that they all may be condemned who did not believe the truth, but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Blessed art thou, Lord our God, King of the universe, who gives the Torah of truth and set everlasting life in our midst. Blessed art thou, O Lord, giver of the Torah. I'm going to try this in Hebrew. Brukata Adonai Elohinu Malaka Lom Asher Natan Lanu Tret Emet Vaishe Alom Nata Betakinu Bruk Ata Adonai Natin Ha Torah. Dead. I probably butchered that, but I'm trying. Alright. 